years since COVID changed the way we live our lives and gather as a community. For nonprofits, it meant canceling fundraisers. And for the third year in a row, sadly, the Share Foundation in Rolling Prairie canceled their spring luncheon. Yeah, but they have alternate plans and need your help to raise money for their adult uh abled vic uh, residents. Chief photojournalist Don Schoenfeld introduces us to the villagers of Sharing Meadows. We have looms that we weave rugs and hand towels and dish towels and... Trying to get this. I'm making a dish towel. I like doing it. We have three classrooms upstairs that our villagers work in. This is called the soap room at Sharing Meadows. And I'm one of the villagers that help make the soap. Well, Share Foundation is an organization that serves other abled adults, adults with special needs or developmentally disabled adults. Um, back in 1982, we had our, our foundation being founded by Father Dennis Blaney, and it was his vision and mission to find something for families who have a child with disabilities. I said, why not have a community where they could live and grow? and, and uh, develop skills that they uh, can't do at home. God wants me to help them. I'm God's helper. You're God's helper, right on. Yeah. Awesome. We focus on our four areas of their quality of life. So their spiritual, physical health, and we also focus on their education and then their work life. In each home, we have 15 homes, lives two of our villagers. They, they live with themselves and their housemate and a live-in caregiver so that we provide 24-hour care just to help them um, cook and help them keep the house tidy and just be a mentor and a friend. And all of our villagers live here and work here on our property. I do have fun cutting up all the soap base and then for the soap and then I, and putting all the fragrances and and oils in. I like to work in here making soap. I was doing wrapping the uh, soap and heat the soap. I went to a click and uh, give it to Mary. And what this gun does is it shrink wraps it, shrink wraps all this. We're sanding soap holders. <laughs> You know, a lot of our villagers growing up, they always wondered, as they saw their siblings grow up, leave the nest, go to college, have a family of their own, live a life of their own. And they always wondered, what is there for me, right? And so Father Blaney, through his mission and vision, has answered that question. And so now the villagers have a life of independence. They live in their own house. They live with their own responsibilities. They get up, eat breakfast, and go to work, just like everyone else. I do like working with everybody here, and it's fun. Plus, we work together as a team. It's teamwork. Yeah. We're also working because we, love, we like to work. We, we like to work together. For 28, 29 years, our luncheon has always been in person, and we sell out at 850 guests. And it's a day where we all come together, we sell villager items, we enjoy a lunch, and it's just a great time for everyone. And because of COVID and, and just out of safety precautions for our villagers themselves, we've decided to cancel the in-person event. And so when you cancel it three years in a row, obviously it's a worry for our organization. Um, but that's why we've created the, the brochure that we have in honor of the spring luncheon, um, selling different villager items and villager gifts that they make in their shops. I like it a lot. It's very soft on the skin. It's not harsh at all. That's why we work so hard. So we, the people who buy this stuff can enjoy it. So here at Sharing Meadows, you know, we're big on, we don't believe disabilities exist. You know, we, we change the game. We, we create opportunities for them to be able to really live out their true gifts and true gifts of making soap, making walking sticks in our, in our wood shop. So we set them up for success so that there isn't a disability. They just have other abilities and we reach into those and allow them to live that independent, you know, responsible life. I know I've got people that care for me here. And I don't have to rely on my family. I'm kind of 
I'm kind of living on my own. This is a great place. You feel safe and very loved here. I enjoy living here because everybody's so nice and they answer questions and when you're having a bad day or something, they help you out. The reason why I'm here is I love Cher. I have a lot of friends. And when you get my soap, you'll also get a card that has a very big heart on it to make people know that I love them very, very much. And I want them to have a happy day. Now, if you would like to help the Share Foundation and maybe you need a Mother's Day gift, they're really nice. Again, look, comes with a little note. We thank you with the hearts. It smells good, too. You can make a donation to receive a gift box and chances to win even more prizes. For more information, we have a link at WNU.com and on our Facebook page. So help them out if you can.